uh, welcome viewers so today we are looking at uh, the angle between a line and a plane so let's consider here the figure below so here we have uh, the base a b c and d and then we have the line v t so the line v t and the plane a b c d intersect at point t projection of the line tv projection mean by the shadow of the line tv that will be formed on the plane given so the projection of line tv will be equals to to will be equals to to now the angle between the plane a b c d and the line tv will be the angle between will be the angle between VTO. So that angle data will be the angle between the line VT and the plane ABCD. So NB, the angle between a line and a plane will be equal to the angle between the line and its projection on the plane given. So in this case, the plane given is ABCD. And the projection TO is on the plane ABCD. Therefore, the angle between the line VT and the plane will be called the angle between the line VT and its projection, which is TO on the plane given. On the plane given. Now, let us look the example. Let us look an example. In the figure below, calculate the angle between the line WQ and plane. P, Q, R, S between the line W, Q and the plane P, Q, R, S. So the first thing we have to look for is we have to find the projection of line W, Q on the plane P, Q, R, S. Now the projection of line W, Q will be Q, S. The angle between the line and its projection. That is the angle required. That is the angle uh, required. So how can we get that angle? So here we have S, Q, W. We already have a W, S. PQ is a 12 of centimeters, QR is 9 centimeters, and uh, VR is uh, uh, 5 centimeters. So already we have WS, which is equal to VR, okay, the height of the, the height of the solid, which is 5. Now, can we get SQ? Now, SQ is the diagonal of the plane P, Q, R, S, which is in this case is the hypotenuse. So if we take that point to be the uh, right angle triangle, then to get SQ, SQ squared should be equal to P, S squared plus P, Q squared. So SQ now will be equal to square root of P, S squared plus P, Q squared. So PS squared, uh, PS is a PS will be equal to 9 squared plus PQ is 12 of squared. So SQ will be equal to square root of uh, 81 plus 144. So square root, what, what is uh, 81 plus 44? That will be 225. Therefore, SQ will be equal to 15. Sorry. So SQ will be equal to 15. So SQ is now 15. So to get this angle now, that is angle Q, we have the opposite and the adjacent. So we use the trigonometric ratio, tan theta. Tan theta will be equal to opposite, which is 5, or adjacent, which is 15. So to get theta, we say 
uh, turn inverse of uh, 1 all over 3 because uh, by 5 1 by 5 we have 3 okay so yeah, therefore theta will be equals to so tan inverse of a third will be equals to 18.43 degrees to four significant figure so that's how you find the angle between a line and a plane the angle between a line and and a plane thank you very much uh, make sure you subscribe and share with your friends bye bye